Ladies and gentlemen, hello everyone, Fax go here and welcome to Hold Fast Nations at War. A few days ago I found this in my Steam library. I don't know how long I have owned it, but uh, I decided to give it a shot and yeah, uh, just see what happened. After finally managing to get into a server that wasn't full or completely empty, I immediately get to vote for the battle and I of course vote for the Austrian-Hungarian versus Prussia battle so I can defeat the beta Germans as an After finally spawning, and not even 3 seconds later, I already hear the music over the voice chat. I would be lying if I said I wasn't expecting that. A few seconds later, me and my teammates are having way too much fun pressing the B button. We're getting closer to the battle and my French mate is having trouble with his schizophrenia which apparently has no microphone. First engagement, I peek around the corner, I spot an enemy, immediately taking aim, shooting and actually hitting, but sadly no kill. This guy is just laughing and I do a tactical retreat. Reloading takes about way too long in this game. My French mate is still talking to random people and I found detected position behind the wall and I completely missed this enemy. This position was even more tactical than I expected because I heard the secret plans of the enemy. Knowing that guys follow me means they are charging, I counter charge. First missing this shot, then charging forward directly into the wall, killing absolutely no one. Then my athletic buddy jumps against the wall, the enemy misses, I block this, he comes over, which is quickly denied by me by killing him. I block this guy again, feeling very overpowered, but I get a stab and kill him. I was trying to get back to my tactical wall position, the enemy thought that he was having a sniper tier today and immediately killed me. While respawning I'm getting flashbacks of my French class. Next respawn, which is followed by a very aggressive push, which is followed by my next death. Back at the spawn, I finally now have background music for this very epic march towards the front. I see a cover in front there and this gives me very big neuron activation so I decided to take a quick position directly next to MS Paint. Quickly leaving the position again because it was just too boring for me. A few of my mates having trouble deciding for what country they fight for. One thing we can definitely say is that the enemies have the better music than us. Oh and behind the tactical wall I made the second kill of the game. And immediately died. I finally used one of the tents to spawn and I decided to use the one with the best name, British Deep Pudding. This guy is having some fights with his inner demons. No, please! No! Please no! Who would have thought that screaming at your enemy is this effective? Not long after the next orders followed, which were shooting the tent, which I of course immediately did and I never felt so good, but the Germans quickly counter-attacked with their music. Having no other choice than using my mouse to vibe to the music, I did that. Aww. Even past Felix was disappointed at the sudden stop of the music. But I quickly returned again. Using this as a distraction, I killed one guy and I decided to flank them. I spot them, making my way to the door, trying to flank. Erika. Amazing singing past Felix. What follows now are very traumatic and very intense scenes of a me storming a house. For about 10 seconds I feel really good, but then the guy from earlier took his revenge on me. Quick important information, walls are tactical and very good, open fields are not. Two very stupid and unnecessary deaths later I discovered something which I thought was impossible. So female players do exist. That's impossible. In the final effort to still win the game, my mate starts playing the techno music and I charge forward with the bayonet. Once again taking an enemy with me, but quickly getting killed. Yep, we lost. We lost against the beta version of the Germans. I am eternally scarred from this and I will maybe never recover. 
My teammate is in the coping modus and she's just writing penis in the chat. And apparently for someone Italy is winning. And Russians are here too. Next round, we are the Italians fighting damn tea drinking Brits and Pingles Nan has finally found a friend or you could say a worthy opponent. First engagement, the enemy tent. I actually managed to hit it, gaining 2 XP at a range of almost 70 meters. Well, I am amazed. I see a white line, I have neural activation. I immediately have to stand next to it. But my mate has a different idea. After missing a shot because my brain was working on deciphering his message, I decide to go in, of course while reloading at the same time. Next respawn, I now have a new trip, I am running around somewhere, completely away from the battle. After finally having found a comfortable position to shoot at the enemy tent, I suddenly hear boss music. Yes, sir. The most incompetent cavalry of all time was attacking us the hell? and I actually had background music. Thank you, Past Felix. A bit later I found another tactical wall, first athletically jumping over this one and then taking my position where I can absolutely see nothing. So I go all in again. Another wall and I shoot into the direction where I think the enemies are and enemies are, but I of course hit nothing. After a very long time, I finally managed to get my first kill of the round. Not even having seen the enemy, just randomly pushing in the direction worked really well. My mate demands our push, so I of course push over the bridge while reloading. What follows? We're trying to take the point in this very intense charging battle where I absolutely do nothing. While reloading, I see this British guy sprinting into my direction, but I get heroically saved by my mate in the last moment. I'm not entirely sure what I was trying to do here, but it looks like a very, very badly executed charge. Running around here like this, I felt like quite an idiot, but I finally spot a target and immediately get shot at, getting hit, and I die. But not without taking this British officer with me. Next respawn, another charge, but I still have the same problems in the same position with the same people. I spot an enemy cavalry, so I immediately charge at it, but he's already dead. But I still got a kill for the horse. Not that it matters. After retreating almost all the way back to the river, this British officer is charging at me, but thankfully he misses, probably because he's the same skill level as me, and I even get the kill. This of course pushes my ego all the way to the moon, and I go into a quick battle, which ends even quicker. Next respawn, and I'm still fighting against the only enemy type that I can, can consistently kill. Horses. But, sadly, all of the enemies are from Peter and I quickly get killed. Next respawn, and I actually manage to get a kill. Not that this is really special, but it rarely happens. Next respawn, and we now have background music, which is only slightly ear raping, so I decide to follow behind. Apparently the music did something, because we won. That was unexpected. Really. Okay, next and last game. This one a bit quicker, because not really much happened here. After that, I respawned, I made a kill, and I died. After the next respawn, I switched to the flag bearer and decided to spam the right click, which looks very, very cool. Sliding over the sand floor like a freaking Michael Jackson. I of course, do what every good flag bearer does. I charge in. I don't think anyone was expecting anything other than what happened. After another painful death, I decide to switch spawn points. After very tactically sneaking around this corner, I actually managed to snipe this guy downhill. Okay, 32 meters isn't really a snipe, but it was a kill. And I found myself in a very tactical position behind this wall. 10 seconds later, and we now have music playing, but apparently music gives me a pretty good buff, because I'm not playing entirely terrible and I actually managed to kill again. I'm vibing to the music by pressing the control key. Yes, this is as far as my guy can get up and down. I spot a guy over there, I take aim and I actually kill him first try. After getting slightly confused by how the controls work, I finally managed to kill this guy while he's in the air. 
After this running long range kill, okay 20 minutes is still not long range, I spot this guy here and my ego tells me that I will kill this guy. As you can see this worked out exactly as intended. Back at the very tactical wall, my mate is laughing and returns back to the screaming strange here. What now follows is my best executed sneak strategy flanking tactic thingy ever. I push around the corner and I kill a guy. And die. Even the music my mate is playing is now sad. Next respawn and I'm now in a different position, which is not very successful. After this death I was no longer able to respawn, so I had to put all my faith into the hand of my trusted teammates. Blasting the enemies with loud music to distract them. Very interesting tactic. This was the second we lost the game. Without the music, the team is completely useless. With only 20 seconds left, the Russians still won and we lost. The biggest disappointment ever since I was last disappointed. And with that I say thank you everybody so much for watching and I hope I will see you guys all again in the next video. And until then, bye bye! Thank you.